Hey guys, what's happening? In this section, it's all about measuring segments and finding segment lengths. So, we're going to answer this problem um, based on the info they give us and find the missing segment length of GH. Cool. Alright, there's a three-step plan I like to do to uh, solve these problems. Number one, I want to draw the diagram. Number two, I want to figure out what formulas I need. And number three, I want to do whatever algebra is required. So that's a good, uh, a good plan for attacking a lot of these problems. So we're going to start with this diagram. See what's up here. Alrighty, it says G is between F and H. So if I'm going to draw a segment, I know that G is somewhere between, I don't know where, somewhere between F and H. Cool. I like it. Um, that's all I need for right now. Now we can go to a formula. we got to think of what, what formula is going to be true for this. And uh, you might remember in class we learned something called the segment addition postulate, which said the length from, from F to G plus the length from G to H. So now we're going from G to H. is equal to that entire distance from F to H. Cool beans. So that's going to be the formula that helps me out. And how did I know that? Well, it said that G is between F and H. So I didn't know exactly where. It didn't say it's in the middle. It just said somewhere between. Um, all right, now let's look at what we got and see what we can plug in. Um, it says that FG is 6, so there we go. It says that FG is 6, so I'll replace that FG with a 6. It says that GH is, we don't know GH, we're trying to find it, so it's still GH. If you really want, you can put an X there, but I'm going to leave it as a GH. And it says that FH is 11. So I'll replace FH with 11. Cool. So we've substituted, and we can do some more algebra. We could um, figure out what GH is by subtracting 6 on both sides. So GH equals, and 11 minus 6 is totally 5. Boom. Oh. So, we found the missing segment length. If you really want to go back and check it, let's, uh, let's do that. If FG is 6 and GH is 5, does that add up to the 11 that it was supposed to be? Totally. Alright, so we know we're good. That's it.